This is the Power Anand uh, 6 1 Listeroid type uh, homemade diesel generator set. Runs uh, right now about 734 RPM. It's been modified with an electric starting system, which comes from Power Anand. As you see, I just add a, uh, any available external 12 volt battery to power the starting system. It's a standard Napa brand uh, serpentine belt, eight ribs, cast iron pulley, ST Chinese generator head, the Fuking brand, about 5 kW. Uh, radiators off a of Honda Goldwing with a fan, and on top here is a uh, the control box is a 12 volt switching power supply with surplus computer part. I don't know, maybe 10, 12 dollars, and it puts out uh, about six amps. It only takes three amps to run the fan. Uh, sitting here is a starter control box. Uh, pretty simple. It just has a coolant temperature gauge, a key, and I've added this control here for the fan speed. It has a wire that runs down to the power supply, and I can change the speed of the fan to regulate coolant temperature hot or cold days. It seems to work pretty well. Um, I added this brace here because I had a little bit of vibration going here with the box jiggling back and forth. But uh, other than that, it's all working pretty well, been pretty reliable. And of course the homemade muffler, which doesn't work that great. I'm going to change it, but it was made out of a Freon R22 can. So I'll crank it up here and I'll put a little bit of a load on it. I have a heater, which is 1,500 watts down here, and I'll plug that in once I get it running. Here we go. That's running right now at about uh, 1,500 watt load, about half power. It'll make upwards of 4,000 watts, but uh, um, it's pretty hard to plug, find loads uh, more than 3,000 watts to plug into it. This is where the coolant temperature probe attaches into the uh, the hot water which is coming out of the cylinder head. It's a traditional Stuart Warner type uh, temperature probe. And now I'll go ahead and shut the engine down. We can watch it wind down. Nothing uh, of note. Uh, that's all, folks.